This £490,000 two-bedroom flat in East London could be yours for £5, with a bottle of champagne thrown in by the young couple who are raffling it off. Jack and Charlotte Smith have been trying to sell their third-story flat in Greenwich for the past ten months. Despite reducing the price twice, they have had no buyers so have decided to offer it as a competition prize. The lucky winner will get the flat, stamp duty of up to £13,000, legal fees up to £1,000 with VAT and a bottle of bubbly to celebrate. Jack and Charlotte Smith are raffling off this property in Greenwich after struggling to find a buyer for almost a year. The winner will get the flat, stamp duty of up to £13,000, legal fees up to £1,000 with VAT, and a bottle of champagne. The couple decided to raffle off their two-bedroom property in Greenwich after struggling to find a buyer for 10 months. The two-bedroom property has an open-plan kitchen and lounge, a full-length balcony and has been recently decorated. Jack and Charlotte Smith decided to raffle off their home in Greenwich after failing to find a buyer for 10 months. The flat was built in 2008 and has two bedrooms, bathroom, open-plan kitchen and lounge and a full-length balcony. It is a short walk from Greenwich Station and close to the famous Cuddy Sark and National Maritime Museum. Mr. Smith, 29, who works as an IT server specialist, said, We've had the flat on the market with two agents for 10 months, but we've had no interest. Related articles previous. One next. Pictured, David Cameron's £2 million Cornish bolt hole that. On the streets of MRS Brown's town, the £3.4 million Florida. David Cameron buys £2 million Cornish holiday home with a huge. Share this article. Share script DM. Later, bundle, function, if, DM. Rotator, new DM. Rotator, p28, pages ice, 1, page count, 1.0, active class, active, rotate, false, dollar. Number P28. Share. On. Click. Function. DMS. Facebook. Post. Tof. Related. There are a lot of new builds at the moment which have first time buyers and government schemes, so we've decided that we'd take a risk and try a prize competition. We reduced the price two or three times. It was initially £490,000 but eventually went down to £465,000. We've done a lot of research, got legal advice, and done market research on the question you have to ask, because it has to be skilled to comply with the Gambling Commission's regulations. I know there are a few other raffles out there making a lot of money for people, but we didn't just want to do that, so we're covering everything, the flat, stamp duty, legal fees and donate £50,000 for charity. The third-story property, in Greenwich is being raffled off after the owners struggled to find a buyer. The property was recently decorated and it is located minutes away from Greenwich Station and just a short walk down to the famous Cuddy Sark. The young couple have decided to offer their home in Greenwich, South East London, as a competition prize. The couple said they were struggling to sell the property due to the Brexit effect and because of the number of new build developments within Greenwich which have government schemes and incentives. A donation of £25,000 will be made to Thrombosis UK after MRS Smith's father, Tony Pierce, died aged 56 from a pulmonary embolism which stemmed from deep vein thrombosis. They will also give £25,000 to SUDC UK, a charity that deals with sudden unexpected deaths in childhood after a family friend's toddler, Rex Gooden, died at just 22 months old. The couple are hoping to sell pound 1300 tickets at five pounds and have sold 2000 in the first two weeks. Mr. Smith said, our friends think it's an unusual idea, but considering how the market is at the moment, they think it's a good one. We haven't decided where to move to because don't know when the raffle will end, so we've moved back in with our parents for now. The competition runs until January 26th, with the winner being announced a week later. Mr. Smith said, we would like to give somebody the opportunity to own a flat in London mortgage-free, London is one of the most expensive places to buy a property and there are many people struggling to save for a deposit. It would be an incredible feeling, handing over the keys to the flat and them not having to worry about a mortgage. 
For more information and to enter the draw, visit prizeproperty.co.uk.